Hi everybody, this is Sherry from Studio 28E. Welcome to my channel. I got some happy mail today from Carol Farney and I'd like to open it and share it with you. I started to open it and then I said, I think I'm just going to film it as I open it rather than take pictures. So there was this purple package and this purple, this beautiful tissue paper. I feel guilty because when I send out happy mail, I do not wrap it this nice. It was sealed with gold tape. Oh, and there's all kinds of tickets. I was wondering what this was. It's like, this seems kind of thick, but... So I've got all kinds of tickets. Looks like some she made with a punch that she has or a die cut, and then some she purchased. Thank you, Carol. And then we have this package that's all taped. I probably should have untaped. Oh, looks like it's coming out along quite nicely. <clears throat> I don't think she wanted me to get into this. <clears throat> to see what she sent because I know she was making flowers and I was going to be getting some of them so I'm kind of excited. Quiet Benny. Some more pretty paper and pretty bow. Try not to destroy it. Oh, wow. I don't really want to open all of these. Hopefully you can see some of them. She has them sealed so nicely. This is um, a teacup and teapot border. sent me some of these a while back and I saved them and so I couldn't save them any longer and I used them and I was sad but look at these aren't they cute all different colors I don't know how many different versions she's got here, color versions, but there's a lot. Thank you, Carol. You know I'll use those because I'm a, I like to do, do tea journals. And here's another one. Looks like fences. So again, I think she sent me before, and I held on to them. Try to have this new outlook on things. Use it. You can buy more. Or make more. Not doing any good sitting in the box and not using it. So, she came along at the right time. Oh, this is really cute. Look at a little bird on a limb. And she cut the bird out of a different color. Can you see those? Sitting on branches. Picket fences. Oh, there's the Tim Holtz man with the umbrella.
Reminds me of Charlie Chaplin. Is that cute? I don't know what this is. We'll see. She wraps things to perfection and makes me feel bad. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, the Tim Holtz teacups and saucers. Lots of those. That's some of my favorites. And then there's two different styles of teacups with that die. So here's the roundish one. Oh, I like that with the butterfly in the center. It looks like cute. Thank you, Carol. Some, I don't know if you'd call these doilies or just mats, but whatever. We can use them behind items. And here's some smaller ones. Perfect sizes. Come out of there. There's another. We really put her die cut machine to use, didn't she? What's this? Oh, the window frames. The window frames and the sills or flower boxes or whatever you want to call them. Those go on the bottom. Put one of those in my new journal that I am working on, butterflies and flowers, and I really like that I decorated it with little tiny flowers and I don't have any idea what this is. Oh yes, I think I do now. Carol, when, when did you find time to do all this? Little bags. Pickle Boy Ben Ben. Inside the bags there are... Oh, these are adorable. I was going to call them something, but I can't remember what she told me she was going to call them. Some little tiny tags. Some more tags. What this looks like it was wrapping paper. I love it. At least in springing. A larger size tag. And an even larger size tag. Great. I will be putting these to good use. And we have this one. Looks like cherry blossom ribbon. Maybe it's apple blossoms, I don't know. There's three glassing bags in here. Oh! Yes, 
Just be quiet. I'm not talking to you. With Tim Holtz feathers. There's some more. And this is another side. Benny is jealous because I'm talking to, not talking to him. And I don't know what this is. But oh, let's look. Quiet. Per perfume bottles. I don't have anything like that. No, Benny, they don't want to listen to you talk. Thank you, Carol. I will be using those for sure. And now we have this. Shh. Be nice. It's wrapped in pink too. Well, she makes me feel guilty now because I don't do this. Wrap my things up so nicely. And here, I must have not been enough to eat. Looks like a vinyl, yes, doily. Shh. And here are the flowers. Oh, well, they're so pretty. Dog bite. Not really. The little one likes to play, and the big one doesn't want to play. And, you know, big brother, big sister kind of thing. Look at those. Those are so pretty. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Beautiful. I have found... Very quickly here. This is probably my last flower I have from the first flowers Carol sent me about two years ago. I hoarded those forever. Um, I just love them. But I think that's the last one I have of that. But thank you so much, Carol. I appreciate your thoughtfulness. Um, I know you thought you took a long time, but good grief, girl. You really uh, you made everything that's here, so... I can't say that you took a long time at all. And thank you so much. And you know how much I appreciate your friendship and your thoughtfulness. We've become good friends. Thank you, my friend. I'll talk to you again later. Bye-bye.